income and poverty statistics gauge the health of the U.S. economy, we're able to see national trends and compare the economic well-being of different groups, such as women versus men, children versus people aged 65 and older, and urban versus rural residents. Income is a measure of all cash or money resources coming into a household. It includes wages and earnings from work, as well as Social Security benefits, retirement income, interest dividends, and public assistance. It does not account for taxes paid, tax credits, or non-cash assistance, such as SNAP benefits, Medicaid, and Medicare. We often talk about changes and trends in median household income. The median is the value that divides the income distribution in half. So half of all households have income above the median, half below. Poverty is a measure of how many individuals live in families with incomes below the poverty threshold, meaning they don't have adequate resources to meet their basic needs. Thresholds vary by the size of the family and the ages of the family members. In 2018, a family with two adults and two children was considered in poverty if their income was below $25,465. Poverty rates help government officials and social services providers develop policies and target benefits. Thank you.